Look, 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 Ah, good old GameStop, man. Well, guys, we've got some interesting things going on in the Call of Duty world on the Treyarch side of the fence. Looks like the good people over at GameStop just pretty much leaked Black Ops 4. It's official, everybody. It's confirmed. Subscribe, everybody. Subscribe. Black Ops 4 is coming out. Subscribe for future Black Ops 4 gameplay. And like I said, man, Vaughn, <laughs> Vaughn's going to be coming out. Mastered Ultra Instinct. Fortnite going to get his ass kicked by Black Ops 4, baby. That's right. I'm calling it right now. Fortnite going to get owned in the tournament of gaming power by, by Black Ops 4. <laughs> anyway, guys, excited about Black Ops 4. Hey, listen, everyone knew it was coming, okay? I mean, GameStop might have officially leaked it, but we all knew. We all knew it was coming. The Black Ops franchise, extremely popular, probably the most successful franchise in call of duty history even if the modern warfare uh franchise actually they're the same franchise call of duty a sniper just missed me at close range this is why i love black ops 3 people don't ever ask me why i play black ops 3 that one clip right there if, if that was called world war 2 modern warfare 2 modern warfare 3 i mean i'd be dead dead wouldn't even stand a chance uh, so <laughs> we're getting black ops 4 big surprise and did you also notice it said COD World at War promotional. What? Why would they have COD World at War on there, fellas? Uh, you know the Brecky ain't missing me at close range. Hell no. <laughs> That's okay, though. It's a shotgun. I can live with that. I can live with getting known by a shotgun at close range. I'm, I'm okay with that. Trust me, fellas. I'm all right with that. But World at War, I have a feeling we could be seeing Black Ops 4. Well, I know we're seeing Black Ops 4. It just leaked, confirmed by GameStop. Subscribe, everybody. Like and favorite the video. And <laughs> we're also going to be seeing possibly a COD World at War remaster. I mean, it's not out of the realm of possibility. We did see COD World at War promotional item leaked on GameStop. Why would they be having a COD World at War promotional item in 2018 unless it was going to get remastered? Now, they already remastered COD 4, and my boy Phil over on Thunderstruck Gaming, I'll link the video down in the description, already did a video pretty much uh, proving that every single... COD game is going to be remastered. All of them. So Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, COD World at War. But if you follow the order of things, they just remastered COD 4. The next game after COD 4 would be COD World at War. Now, I know people are saying, why would they do two back-to-back -back COD World War 2 games? Even I said doing two back-to-back -back COD uh, World War 2 games would be dumb. But this COD World War 2 remaster is not the main game. Black Ops 4 Modern Warfare is the main game. The remaster would just be a side dish. The COD World at War remaster. I don't mind a, a second COD World War II game as a side dish. And dude, World at War remaster, I think would actually be good. Now COD 4 remastered sucked because it was nothing but head glitching and camping. COD 4 is a, uh, a head glitcher's paradise, man. World at War is rushing. Everyone rushes in World at War. World at War is probably the least camper friendly game that's ever been created. It's nothing but dudes with MP40 jugs bull rushing each other non-stop all game long and just hip firing the crap out of each other. Okay, trust me, I played a lot of COD World at War. That's how that shit goes down. So I'm hyped to see a COD World at War remaster. I think it will be a lot more fun than the COD 4 remaster was. I only lasted, holy crap, man. I think I lasted longer on Infinite Warfare than I did on uh, Modern Head Glitch Remaster. As a matter of fact, I think I even said in a few videos I'd rather play Infinite Warfare. Oh, bring those raps in, baby! <laughs> I even said I think I'd rather play Infinite Dog Shit than Modern Head Glitch Remaster. I mean, Modern Head Glitch Remaster, it just it did not age well, man. It's just too boring of a game for me to play. I mean, honestly, it's even more boring than COD World War II. That's how boring Modern Head Glitch Remaster was. Uh, ooh, eat that C4, baby! Got the combat focus, and Raps putting it work. All right, fellas, so COD World War II as a pre-order bonus with Black Ops 4 Modern Warfare Remaster. Are you buying it? All you guys who said you quit Call of Duty and never playing Call of Duty again, 
is a modern warfare from Treyarch with a COD World War II remaster, enough to get your pre-order. Ooh, the triple threat, baby? I'm saying yes. Triple threat calling card. I'm just getting that shit now? Damn. I don't even know what that is. <laughs> anyway, speaking of things that are just happening now, do you know that Treyarch, like I said, guys, a lot of interesting things happening on the Treyarch side of the fence. Now, Treyarch just updated Redwood. They put snow on it. Yeah, it's a new map. Redwood snow, just like Winter Crash. So I, I haven't played on the map yet. Uh, it looks like it'll be fun, though. Looks like, you know, I like Redwood. Redwood's a great map. You guys know I've uploaded tons of Redwood gameplays there. Redwood with snow. Sounds pretty cool. They also added an infected game mode, a new assault rifle, a new sniper rifle. Gotcha, bitch! The Treyarch is ready to make it happen in 2018, baby. We ain't dead yet, fellas. The COD community, we ain't dead yet. Daddy Treyarch is back. Son Vondahar got that Ultra Instinct cheese. And I'm predicting big things for Call of Duty in the year 2018, fellas. And if you guys enjoyed this gameplay commentary, please don't forget to yeah, just do what the surf is doing right there. Drop a like on the video, a thumbs up. It is greatly appreciated. Thank y'all so much for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.